Here we are again, third YouTube video back. Today we have another run with special guest. <laughs> I think because we did one mile, then we did 1.5 miles. What if we do two miles today? Dan doesn't care because he just went for his first run in like forever and ran three miles. Loved it, loved it. Felt so great. Let's aim for two. Let's do it. And let's talk about why am I back on YouTube? Shorts, mediocre bra, tank top, shoes. Thank you, Bucky. I just got back from Minneapolis yesterday and um, I was there for 24 hours for a video that I think I can talk about now. By the time this is posted, it should be out. I tried curling with an Olympic curler, Chris Plies. Super fun. <coughs> Dan's coughing, Bucky's scratching and thumping the floor. So you're gonna have to deal with trying to film a video. <laughs> yeah, curling is a super interesting sport. Um, it looks a lot easier than it is. Like I'm, I, I'm very sore. That's a combo of it actually being difficult and me just having no upper body strength because I don't like lifting things. Okay, it might rain. Bucky's on a diet. Vet mandated diet. Reminder to everyone, don't, don't be mad at yourself. Let's go. So let's talk about why I'm back on YouTube. Um, yeah, so it's been a while, but this is like my third video back. Doing pretty good. I feel like because I'm filming on the phone, there's like no friction to get film equipment or mics ready. It's just like, go film. And also just doing like super simple edits. Just cut, rough cutting up a video, putting it out there, and then all of us talking about it, and I friggin' love it, and I miss it. And I love like short form videos a lot, obviously. But like, you can't just ramble to the camera like a friend, like you're talking to a friend. I think that's what I miss about YouTube, so. Um, I'm like, okay, what do I have to do to get back to it? And I think this for now is working. This wind is not working. And I think it's a good time to start back up because I'm wittily starting over in a way back at super low mileage. And I think it could be like relatable for some people that are struggling with like starting over with anything. On short form videos, you have to cram everything in, like a whole friggin' story into like 30 seconds. And there's no room for oversharing. That's what I do best. <laughs> Dan's like, yep. <laughs> <laughs> also on YouTube, I mean, you, you, ha you can't say like certain things, but I don't say stuff like that anyway. Like I don't really curse or talk about bad things, but on other platforms, won't name names, I've said the word poo, and whenever I say that, not even like the SH word or anything, I just say poo, um, I get a warning on my video that it's sensitive content, and, that, and it doesn't show it to viewers unless they click on it purposefully. That's unacceptable. And YouTube doesn't do that. I like that about YouTube. Thank you. Keep being, keep being you. Look at that view. What a beaut. Look at that view. <laughs> Dan, I just realized something. This run that we're on right now. Yeah, it's beautiful. Wait is the first run that we're on together yeah. without having to have anyone watch the kids. Right. Let that sink in. Yeah. <laughs> That's crazy. I just realized that. Our youngest just started preschool. And uh, it's only two days a week, but still, if Dan and I wanted or had to go on a run together, in the past, we always had to get someone to at least watch the youngest while the other two were in school. Game changer. Okay, the highlight and also most unexciting part of the video 
is let's see how we did. 202 over achievers. Oh, a little faster than 13 minutes per mile. Well, that's improvement, but let's see what happened to the heart rate. Not bad, before that was all red. Not bad, progress. It's because I had Dan, the good, the good vibes. <laughs> the good man. It's a good. I really needed that shower, um, but I did just want to say, sure, why is it so bright? I'm filming, Dan. Oh. I did just want to say that judging by the comments from my first video back, there are some of you that, yes, you only do. You widow, we only have YouTube. Um, so you don't have any other way to catch up with what I'm doing. If you like longer form content, I have a podcast called Non-Members Only, where I definitely overshare everything on there. And um, I mentioned that I just got back from Minneapolis. We were there 24 hours. So podcast Mike and I talked about that trip while we were there. So um, you can catch up that way too. Um, and also we're on Instagram at non-members only, not like you have Instagram, but um, yeah, just search non-members only wherever you get your podcasts. Okay, bye.